change in three very basic ways to support learning. And the first is chemical. The brain actually functions by transferring chemical signals between brain cells, what we call neurons, and these trigger a series of actions and reactions. Chemical signaling is taking place between neurons. Now, because this kind of change can happen very rapidly, this supports short-term memory, or the short-term improvement in the performance of a motor skill. The second way that the brain can change to support learning is by altering its structure, the connections between neurons. Now, here, the physical structure of the brain is actually changing, so this takes a bit more time. These types of changes are related to long-term memory, or long-term improvement in a motor skill.
had teachers who told me things like, if you want to be great, you have to learn how to be drunk and high. That's like all the great ones do. But we tried it. It's just messed up.
Wake up, wake up.